SEO is like a tough puzzle, and picking the right tools like SEMrush, now known as SEMrush and Arefs, can make or break your ability to rank. The Rumble of the SEO Titans First off, I've used both these tools extensively, and as an SEO enthusiast living in Portland, Oregon, I've learned that it's more about how you use the tools than the tools themselves. But hey, we all want the best tech we can get our digital hands on, right? Data Accuracy – The Heart of SEO Tools Accuracy matters in SEO. If you're tracking the wrong keywords or backlinks, you might as well be bringing a knife to a gunfight. SEMrush and Arefs both boast massive data collections and are frankly ahead of many competitors. SEMrush prides itself on keyword research and domain analytics, which is like a treasure trove for anyone intent on digging deep into market analysis. Their position tracking tool is my go-to for keeping an eye on rankings. Arefs, on the other hand, might just have the edge, albeit a very slight one, on backlink analysis. Their database often feels fresher and more expansive, so when I'm hunting down backlinks or assessing a competitor's link profile, Arefs is my trusty sidekick. Usability, the user's experience. An accurate tool that's as complicated to use as a cryptic crossword isn't going to help anyone. Both SEMrush and Arefs are actually quite user-friendly, although they come with steep learning curves. If you're just starting out, you may find Arefs a tad easier to navigate, but once you get used to SEMrush's interface, it's as smooth as the Willamette River on a calm day. Keyword Tracking Keeping an eye on performance for keyword tracking. SEMrush usually feels more robust to me. They have an extensive keyword database and offer a variety of metrics that help understand how a keyword is performing. Not only does it show volume and difficulty, but it also provides actionable insights which can be used to bolster your content strategy. Backlink Analysis – The SEO Backbone I won't mince words here. RFs is my go-to for backlink analysis. It's not that SEMrush doesn't do a good job, it does, but RFs updates seem more frequent, and their data presentation is exceptionally clean and easy to understand. When I'm scouring for new link opportunities, RFs feels like it has more meat. Extras – the cherry on top. Both tools offer unique features. SEMrush has its Traffic Analytics and Market Explorer, which are great for understanding the competitive landscape. RFs has a Content Explorer that's nifty for finding content ideas that have already performed well. The Verdict – Who Wins the SEO Crown? As for accuracy, it's honestly too close to call. If you forced my hand, I might lean slightly towards SEMrush for keywords and RFs for backlinks. But remember, SEO tools are there to inform your strategy not define it. Whether you're in Portland, Poughkeepsie, or Plymouth, it ultimately boils down to your specific needs and how well you understand the results these tools churn out. A wise man uses the tool. A wiser man knows that he's the real tool. That's the brain managing the data. So, take these insights, tread the SEO path wisely, use free trials if available, and may the best rankings be in your favor.